hello everybody so in last video we saw how to make this interface the LCD with the A051 so today we are going to do the same thing but this was the code in last time and you will see in last video that this procedure if you are you want to show the short messages so you can use this procedure like send each character with each line but if you want to show the length lengthy messages then this will be headache so what you what we will do we will take help of arrays and the pointers to show the messages so it will be a little shorter way and uh, easy for debugging uh, whenever there will be error so let's delete this and make an array first of all so you have to make the array with character data type because we are sending the character and you have to choose one variable for the array so suppose I am choosing a then you need to make a string so whatever you gonna show just write it so I am going to show the aura text so I am making this array so this is my string and I need to give the size so let's see how much size it is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So size is 10. That's why I'm giving the size 10. Now you're gonna need one integer value. So take one integer. Suppose it is k. And you're gonna need to make a for loop which will run from 0 to 9. So k equals to 0 k is running from 0 to 9 when it will become 10 it will get out of the loop and we are incrementing the k now what you gonna do you will call the lcd data function and you will pass the value of k in the array and from there to the lcd data so whatever will be the k now that will be sent to the lcd data suppose k is 0 then a of k means a of 0 it will check what is a of 0 a of 0 is o so it will send the o so this is one procedure let's make it on the second column okay now let's see what is the output and see we can show the aura text over here let's take it on the second row this is a comment it doesn't matter whatever you write over after these two objects so I am putting it in the second row and I am making it to the third column and you now you can see that we have made array this was the pattern of array so let me comment you comment here for you that this is an array method you can use this method or there is one more method I will tell you here you have to make one more function and in this function you need to take one pointer so I'm ta taking a pointer suppose C so I've taken a pointer now I'm going to make define that function over here so in this function what I'm going to write first of all I will check whether the C is empty or with the data so it will check whether C is not equals to 0 if it is not equals to 0 means there is some data if then if there is some data then it will print the value whatever in the pointer C and it will increment after the printing so this is a very short data and uh, this will this is easy I always use this display function now you don't have to make any array you can simply write even between these two inverted commas. So 
so I'm writing subscribe to now before that I will put here some command LCD CMD zero cross I want this in the first row and uh, second column first row I'm writing here on purpose that this is on this is below and this is above because I want to show you that doesn't matter even if you write the first row in here or the second row over here it will just check the command and print your message this is the pointer method let's execute this compile this there is zero error uh, ignore this one warning this is because of my license it's got expired now let's see and you can see here is the output subscribe to our text so I hope you have learned something from this video I will explain this what we did first we use the array method in the array method we made one array of character this is the string we gave the size and then we take the variable k for the for loop so it is running from 0 to 9 when it is 0 it comes here it sends O when it is 1 it comes here it shows it gives R when it is 2 it comes here gives H when it is last one 10 9 then it will A of 9 is S then it will send the S on the LCD this was the uh, this was one method and second method was making pointer so we made a pointer take one pointer C and we uh, check the value is 0 or not so as there is data no 0 u b r t o till o there was the there wasn't any 0 so it creep keep printing the lcd and incrementing one by one and when it reached after o so there was nothing so there was 0 so the condition wasn't satisfied so simply come out of the loop so this was all from this video i hope you have learned something from this video so if you like this video please like it share with your friends if they want to learn too if you have any kind of query please comment down below and please please subscribe thank you